Hi, I'm here with a good friend, Rich from Siemens Energy, and we've met a couple times over the past and talked about what their company's doing with energy. And today, he had so much enthusiasm and so much excitement. I said, before you go, we grab a quick video. Uh, give us just a thumbnail of what you're doing with hydrogen. So hydrogen's really an exciting business for us. It, it, it started out as a prototype, and now it's turning into real life. And where we really see the opportunities taking hydrogen and running it through mobility, trains, buses, so going to industrial. The, so to think this real though, you are on the cusp of putting in a hundred electrolyzers. If you don't know what that is, that's a, it's something you'll want to figure out what it is. It basically takes an energy source and makes hydrogen. And you can do that now practically and affordably at a large scale. Correct. And when I say large scale, give them a sense of what you're working on right now. So, you know, we're, we're talking, we used to be talking about small one units, and now we start talking about hundreds of units. Which hundreds of units that can power power plants, that can power buses, trains, uh, and make ammonia so that you get cr uh, green fertilizer. Okay, and we could talk about this for an hour, but yeah. what this means is, we can have energy independence as a country. Correct. We can have low, affordable energy prices. We can have a strong economy, and you're talking zero emissions. Zero emissions. Yeah. So that's the point, is we, if we do this right, we can be clean and friendly to the environment. We don't have to sacrifice the US economy. We don't have to sacrifice energy independence. As a matter of fact, it fuels those things. And, and that's the important thing, is we can't sacrifice that, because that's our competitiveness as a nation. We need to make sure we've got clean, sustainable, reliable, safe power. Affordable. And the last one is affordable, because if it isn't affordable, it doesn't become a business. And if it's not a business, it's not a sustainable business. You heard it here, we're calling that cleaner.